It's too big. It sounds too bold. But some, somehow I've always been really intrigued by that idea to create my very own pictorial universe, my, uh, my own abstract reality. So this is it. So. Uh, that's that's how I always wanted to express myself, but but I'll try to explain. Reality is opposed to the spiritual, and I'm fascinated. Or I just I very much like that idea that there might. be be another an abstract reality that's located more in the transcendental areas of human existence and it's it's just not about the shapes and forms alone or not even just about the psychological interactions of effects of the interaction of color it's about those relationships it's about those universal relationships these elements represent <laughs> but there is it's not even a trick there is a simple way what you can do if you don't have that kind of professional experience just spend a bit of more time with a painting is it more difficult to understand a narrative or a conceptual art no, I don't think so. It's just more difficult to explain, to explain in words, in language. It should not be overthought. You could compare it to, to music. No need trying to read or decipher too much. Abstract paintings just require or they encourage a different, a more proactive way of seeing, but proactive in a way that you very actively should open yourself, open your mind, open your senses, open yourself to that visual experience. And an abstract pictorial space is just a reality of its own.